You're watching News for Today. Welcome back at 639. The pandemic has changed the way we do just about everything. No group meetings mean orchestra rehearsals are out, but a local youth orchestra is using new computer software to make their rehearsals work. Those with the Chesapeake Youth Symphony Orchestra say this upgrade will change everything. Melissa Malay joins us to explain how it all works. Melissa, good morning. Good morning, guys. So it's called Jam Kazam, and it's getting this youth orchestra one step closer to normal. So one, two, three, one. Ba, 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 They've been rehearsing online. But no matter who you ask here, it's just not the same. This is the Chesapeake Youth Symphony Orchestra, 120 students strong from all over D.C. and Maryland. Though some smaller groups from the orchestra have been able to meet in person, standard online rehearsals with everyone, well, they've been hard. Enter Jam Kazam. They can see each other and they can play together in absolute real time. Software made for musicians. It's yielded incredible results in terms of uh, individual improvement. To rehearse music in a virtual environment. I think it's going to be a real game changer in how the youth orchestra is going to have to function. A huge change. I'm very excited. With no delays we've grown used to with online meetings. It seems like a really great opportunity to play around with new technology and the capability of singling out certain musicians if you want to know like what the second bassoon is doing you can turn them up hear what's going on with them the students are loving it i feel like this is going to work really well hopefully the youth orchestra has no in-person performances on the schedule right now but jam kazam has them thinking about a live stream concert now that we have this cool technology i feel like we can play again almost like it was before Pretty cool. So for more on the youth orchestra or this uh, new program that they're using, head to my Facebook page. Back to you guys.